go into the funny. I don't know if you guys will like this topic, but I don't know. I like doing it. Hey. So, what is up, guys? Hand gestures. Oh, actually, I need to fix my hair. Fuck me. Urban rock star Matt Wax. For the win. Get the gangster hair shark thing. Because I'm a gangster. Okay, so what is up, guys? I am back, and I am 63Z. Back here with another vlog after my waiting vlog about a week after that, to be honest. I quite liked editing that vlog and it made me kind of like doing these. So I have actually a couple more topics I want to talk about in separate vlogs. Obviously it's going to have its own one like the other one did. And if you tried to guess how many times I said waiting in it for that vlog, you were probably wrong. Because I was wrong. And everyone else who tried to guess is wrong. I guessed 78. My friend guessed 82. My other friend guessed 71. I have no clue, because I suck at counting. Anyway, so being tired. And there's so many different types of being tired. <coughs> Everyone's been tired in some way, shape, or form in their life. Not just, you know, you've come back from the gym and you're exhausted, kind of tired like this. <sighs> or you've just gone for a huge run and you're kind of tired like this. It's kind of awkward waiting for myself to edit it and myself doing the little, anyway. And I'm not just only talking about the kind of tired where you've just woken up in the morning and you're fucking dead. Like this. It's kind of like everything. That all contributes to it. Like being tired in the morning you can either be just not have any sleep the night before. Like I actually had last night. Last night I only had two hours of sleep. And I don't know, I'll tell you guys that story in a sec. It's a matter of being tired is horrible. It destroys not only your motivation but it destroys your want to do anything. Like for me when I'm tired I get headaches and... I have headaches all the time and it pisses me off to the point where I just can't even do anything. Kind of like when I'm waiting. But being tired destroys your motivation and just makes you feel bleh. Everyone's had that moment where they're just bleh. bleh. And today I was actually going to be recording a, a review video on the Gears of War for beta. I didn't even know if it's still going or not because I've just had that much to do in these past couple days. Probably after I finish recording this and the next one I'll be going over to that and then I'll see if it's still there. If it's not there, then I'll actually start to do my DIY music video. Oh. Spoilers. Grr. So, obviously at the moment, I'm fucking dead. I'm tired as all hell. And that's because I actually have one of those mornings where I didn't sleep much at all. And I woke up in the morning feeling tired, but at the same way, I wasn't tired. Somehow. Like, I woke up in the morning and I knew I was tired. I wanted to be tired. But I was just lying there like, I'm way too awake. I'm too awake to life. And that's the same thing with a lot of things. If you're like me, being tired is something you don't like to do. So, a lot of people I know will go to sleep past 12 o'clock at night. And they'll wake up at like 8 o'clock in the morning. They don't like to sleep too early so they can get a lot more done. And they will need to wake up early so they can go to like uni or they need to go to work or something like that. My face is really getting blurred out a lot from this. Kind of better? It's kind of more even. I'm just using a shitty little lamp. I'm tired. Being tired is hard. It's hard work. Because... Anything you do when you're tired feels like a thousand times more difficult. It's the same when you don't have any motivation. If you don't have any motivation to do something, anything you do feels like... If I was to throw... If I was to throw this puffer, like that... Oh, sh... What the fuck? Snapchats... If I'm trying to throw... Fuck, I've got to do it again, I don't know. If I was to throw my puffer like this, when I'm tired, that feels like a lot more effort. When I'm awake, if I was to throw it, I'd be like... Like that. It's a lot easier. You should have more effort to do everything. And effort is not an abundance I have. Wanting to do stuff is just not something I have. I'd rather sit in bed all day and watch How I Met Your Mother Marathon rather than go out and do shit. I love going to the movies, I love going to the beach, I love doing all these things. But when I'm tired, I really don't want to. That's why just being tired is one of the worst things you can possibly be. And it's not even that bad. You're waiting and you don't know what's happening. It's so bad because you don't know what's going to happen. But with tired, you know what's going to happen. Which is the worst part because it's like, oh, I'm, I'm going to be so fucking tired today. I'm not going to want to do anything. I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm not going to want to see any people. So you just really avoid everything and anyone. And you're all just like, <laughs> don't look at me. Yeah, I did that. For quite a while, I was always someone who fell asleep at 1 in the morning and woke up at 10 or 10.30. Like I had my alarm set for 9.30 so I can physically start to wake myself up. I'll still go back to sleep, but I won't be as deep as sleep. And then when 10, my 10.30 alarm comes along, I'm awake. Because by that time, I've already been affected by the light for long enough for it to start to affect my retinas. And then at 10.30, I'm, I'm just that, that much more awake because I've had an hour to adjust without trying to adjust. Even though that's only 9 hours of sleep, maybe, something like that. I'll give it like 3 or 4 weeks. 
I've been going to sleep maybe three or four in the morning and still waking up at 10.30. And that's a lot less time to sleep. And anyone who has not slept a lot knows exactly how that feels to not sleep much. Last night, I had everything turned off by 10.30. I was, not 10.30, 12.30. I was still messaging a couple people at 12.30, but I turned off my phone at 1. The next thing I know, I'm just lying in bed, tossing and turning, and, and then all of a sudden, it's fucking 5 in the morning. And I look at my phone like, wow, I've been tossing and turning for this damn long. But I tried to message some people to see if it would, like, you know, get everything out of my mind so I can just go to sleep. And it didn't work. It was then at the point of 7.30 where I just started to get more of a headache, and more of a headache, because when I don't sleep easily, I get headaches. Like, if I want to stay up for an all-nighter, I'll do it. I'll just drink, like, Monster Mother, Red Bull V, this shit. I don't drink Mother usually because it makes me puke, but I have a leftover from a party. I'll just drink that all night, and then I stay awake through the night, and I'm fine. Then by the next day, around about 5 or 6 o'clock, I'm struggling to keep my eyes open, and then I fall asleep like 8 or 9 o'clock. Simple. But if I want to sleep, and I can't sleep, I get headaches. Something fierce. Oh, my... <sighs> Ooh, that was a good one. Ooh. So say 8 o'clock, mum and dad and Toby, they're all running around, walking around, going to work and getting up because they're all fucking adults. And I call mum saying, you know, can you bring me in some Nurofen? Can you fill up my water bottle? Because I drink from this. I fill this up like almost every single day. And in one night, I'll probably go through like that much water. Last night, I had a full cup and a spare full cup, all the size of this. That's a lot more of water. I had two cups of that plus this and I went through it all. And I wasn't even trying. I was just lying down, waiting for the headache to go, and I kind of just dozed off for about an hour. Then my alarm hit, and I was just, no, I can't go back to sleep after this alarm, you know? It's too bright outside already. The sun's up. Fuck it. Ever get those moments where you're just like, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I had one of those moments. I just really could not be fucked. I have a movie to go to after this, as well as record another vlog. Maybe record some videos of War 4 if I feel like it, if it's still going. If you're tired right now, leave a like. If you've ever felt tired, leave a like. If you will ever be tired, subscribe and if you like this video i honestly swear no scam no no scheme or anything like that if you like this video there'll be if you like this video you'll go to sleep tonight easily promise no scam no nothing if you like this video right now right now you'll go to sleep tonight like a baby so thank you guys for watching like and subscribe and i will see you all in the next video Maybe chilly. i feel like a dragon I don't know what you're talking about.